Welcome back, folks. Uh, hopefully today I have a shared idea with you. For some of you guys that watch the streams, you guys already kind of know about this. We've been talking about this on and off for a year. But I think I would make a video on it just to see what everybody thinks about this. And this is going to be how to fix comps. So this is just my idea. <laughs> if you guys seem to really like it, I might try to link it and send it to Fish and Planet. Maybe they'll look at it and see. I don't know. Uh, they're pretty good about taking feedback so we'll see but anyway my idea how to fix comps guys right now we have amateurs and we have the regular ones and as you guys know um the same people win it a lot and and I, it's not a complaint thing i'm one of these people so uh for example if you guys just to use me as a reference so nobody gets mad at anybody else salmon clash for you guys that know salmon clash or triple trout I win them quite a bit. Um, I haven't done them as much now recently uh, because of that. And, and for example, on Salmon Clash, I went 12 times in a row where I won it or got second place. And that's not a lot of fun for other people. And I, I hopefully today we're going to talk about a way to fix that for everybody where um, the people that are, you know, want to play it like me can still do it and not feel bad for people that might not have a good chance at it. All right, so my idea is to get rid of this amateur setup the way it is. Right now, it's based on levels, and I think that's not a good way of doing it. How I would do this is, you know, so right here is an amateur. So you got to be a certain level for it, and a lot of times, as you can see, they just get canceled. So right here, you're going to see a lot of them are canceled. There's one, there's one, and what they could do, in my opinion, is... Instead of doing it that way, um, they could have a pro and an amateur within that same hour. So you're not, like this hour would be a triple trout. There could be an amateurs and a pros. And how you would set it up is if you have more than 10 podiums on your account, you become in, you go to the pro lobby. If you have less than 10, I'm just using 10 as the point reference number. It doesn't have to be 10. It could be whatever fishing planet thinks it is. But for me, I think 10 podiums is enough to say, or or even or even five podiums is enough to say, okay, you can, you're good enough now. You don't need to be in the amateurs anymore. And take away the level requirement. And I'm going to show you why. I think you take away the level requirement and you worry about the podiums instead because that's more important. Now, is in Fishing Planet, we've had, if you guys didn't know, you can't have two accounts on one platform. Um, uh, we showed this a while back, and we showed it with the issues with comps. I think about a year ago, we showed um, second accounts are not allowed, and then on any, uh, on you can have two accounts that's not on the same platform. Um, and... We showed that in it right here in Triple Trout Amateurs. Now, I don't want to accuse any player of anything, but we're going to take a look at this TS Predator. And this is why the amateurs are broken and they need to, I think, in my opinion, they should get rid of them the way they are. And this would, the reason I'm showing this is it would fix the system uh, the way we're talking about. So TS Predator won this. They seem to be a decent fisherman. I'll go show you what I mean, what you, what, what I'm talking about here. We'll go to the top 100. Yeah, he's in the amateur comps. He's in the top 100. Let's scroll down here, and this player is only a level 31, <laughs> and he's in the top 100. He's a level 31. Now, I don't want to say this is a second account, but <laughs> yeah, it. Yeah, I don't know who this is. It's safe to assume it's a second account, obviously, but I don't know for sure. And uh, he only has 168 comps, and because he's in amateurs, he's destroying every amateur's comp there is. And so he's just sitting there farming points. And if you did the new way, if you did the way I was talking about, that gets rid of this, because once that guy gets five or five or ten top podiums you would move them to pro and it doesn't matter what level it is 
Because I know level doesn't mean anything in this game. I'll be very clear about that for you guys that are kind of newer to the game. Level just means you unlock different gear in lakes. That's all it is. It doesn't make you a good fisherman or a bad fisherman. There's players like this that are only level 31. Obviously, this is probably a second account. Uh, but there are people that are 31 that are decent fishermen. And I've seen people that are, you know, uh, level 80 with 100 or 900 prestige that don't even have a comp win. Uh, so I think that's pretty relevant on that fact. You guys let me know on this what you guys think. I think this is a good way of doing it. Uh, because it kind of just prevents the same people. You know, if somebody's new to comps and they want to try something and it gives them a chance to actually go against other people that are learning how to do comps as well. So kind of interested to see what you think, having a pro and an amateur version on the same time frame so that you're not having these, because sometimes you get like five amateurs in a row and the regular nobody can do regular comps for you know, six to eight hours because they're all in the line. And you'd be able to have people do amateurs, you know, the way, you know, without them getting canceled all the time. Um, but I think that would prevent this. That would help slow down second two accounts on one platform so people aren't farming amateurs because once you win so many, you go to the normal group. Anyway, let me know what you guys think down in the comments. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. We'll see you next time, folks. Thank you.